Guys, this is it. This is Chrono Trigger with episode 17 of The Walking Dead. And we are on the very last episode, finally. No time left. So, we will see how this goes. So, uh, in last episode, we got back. Um, actually, in last episode, um, Lee fell asleep, wandered outside, got bit, told the others, and they went to go find Vernon. Vernon's camp was... Um, Something happened to it. I'm going to leave it at that because I don't want to ruin it, but the game will probably do it previously on, and I'm screwed. So, wait a minute. My new game got deleted. Whoa. Okay, anyway, so this is, bit, this is episode 17 with Chrono Trigger, and let's jump right into the new episode. The last episode, except for the special. I don't know what the last picture looks like. That's Lee. That's coming time. Ay, 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 ay. Okay. Whoa. Can we see a preview? Oh! What? Um, I, don't, I can't make out anybody in this. Oh, crap. Oh. No, we're not deleting it either. No time left, guys. Sorry to... I've just been kind of shocked at the way the last episode ended. You guys will see in a sec. But this looks like it's going to be a quick one. We're going to sum everything up and finish it off. I think we'll end at 20. Um, better be sooner. And yeah, this is episode 17 of The Walking Dead with me, Chrono Trigger. Let's see how this goes. I think the game might have frozen up because... Um, the 51 in the corner of the screen, you know, my, my Fraps recording speed. The 1 is in the corner, and the 5 is kind of off, like it was just changing. No, oh, no, oh, never mind. This is intense. I, I, it's 3 o'clock in the morning. Like, I've been staying up that late. I want to speed right through this. I want to see what happens here. The Telltale has hooked. Oh, by the way, before I continue on, um, they're actually making a second game. So maybe the 400 days is actually the beginning of the second game. Who knows? We'll see. And I don't know who the mystery man on the radio is. So I'm all hooked. And I could play this on my own, but you guys, I want to, I want to, I want, to, I want to see it through your guys' eyes. You know, I don't know what's up ahead. I don't know what's going on. I want to see this. I still have a drink of meal with me from the last episode. So I'm gonna keep drinking my mio, mio mayo, mio mayo. I'm shocked. I'm so, I'm so shocked we got bit. Wow. Wow. How long was Duck there before he died? An hour or two? Previously on The Walking Dead. Yeah, it's going to spoil it. That's okay. Before you, you guys watch this, I want you to go see the previous what episode. My parents come home but, and I'm not there. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Oh, that's all the way back in the first episode. Baby, you gotta see this. Here, Clem. Want some uh, batteries? Ah. I think we should look for your parents. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House. Yes, that's it. The guy who had the truck. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go. Oh, this really is it. Yeah. Why? I didn't think this was it. Clementine. Oh. Oh. Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. If this was me asking you for help, would you be there for me? I need your help. Of course Please. I would, but this is a rerun. But you're on your own on this one. I swear, before this is all over, I'm going to show you I can do something right. Oh, the bass drop. Ooh. 
Who is this guy? It's not the dad. I mean, the mystery guy who was watching us who gave me the heart attack, that wasn't the dad either. You could tell. And he's talking like he has their parents or knows their parents. And he's a friend. Well, he's a friend because Clementine believes that. I was thinking about when she first said that, I thought it was before the outbreak. But she probably, he probably tricked her. Who is this guy, though? We shall find out. I don't care how long it takes for me to finish this. I'm doing it. Although that last picture doesn't give me any, you know, hope. I mean, that could be Lee's body. That's all cringing. <sighs> this game is crazy. I'm going to buy the second one. Not when it comes out the first thing. I'm saving that money for Half-Life 3. Which is, uh, seems like more rumors are coming out. And it's getting closer and closer. But... This has to be a new favorite game of mine. There's a lot of replay value, tons of replay value. Um, there we go, guys. It's kind of like what happened in The Walking Dead, the show, when it showed all the walkers in the trees. Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Clementine, are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch. Cody. Who Where have you it? taken her? This isn't Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Who is this? Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. What do you want from me? Whatever it is. Do it. You can let her go. I want you to never hurt anybody again. This isn't the kidnapping league. Then what is it? A rescue. What? Huh. Just hold on, Clementine. I'm coming for you. This is bad, but we can deal with it together. We're going to need to hurry. You just changed positions, Ben, you ghost. How's that feeling? Still alive. That's something. Yeah, totally. <laughs> we don't have a lot of time. Shut the door. We're about to have a lot less. We three will stop them getting in. Lee, find a way out of here. Okay. I said it. Wow, tie this up. Tie up. Whoa. It's changed. What is it? Saw? Rib spreader. Oh. Looks like a carjack. I don't want to imagine this being used on a body. Okay. Empty. Oh, I didn't say it. Just some surgical supplies. Take that hacksaw. Nothing. Well, there's a lot of options there. Hey, I think I found a way out. Hmm. It's cool. I'll have these doors open in two seconds. Oh, 
Oh man. Wow. They should have cut his arm off, really. What the hell happened? It's the bite. Well, what can we do? I don't know. Help me move him. Cut his arm off. Jesus. Are you sure this will help? You got any better ideas? Okay. It's now or no. Stop! He's awake! He's awake! He's bitten. We've still gotta do something. Do we have to cut it off, though? We're trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. But this way? Do we know it works? Of course not. Is there gonna be a lot of blood? There's gonna be a shitload of blood. What if he dies? Then the rest of us go after Clementine and get the hell out of Savannah. If there's any chance this saves his life, we have to take it. Let's do it. Maybe it'll work. It's a big risk. Yeah. We're down here without a lot of options. Punch him in the... Fuck it. Cut it off. Seriously? Yeah. Knock him out. It'll be over before you know it. Just gotta get through. Oh man, don't show it. Oh shit. I'll go as fast as I can. Oh, I'm taking the headphones off if this happens to sound. Uh, uh. Take the watch. Oh my God. You're alive. It was getting to the point where we figured you weren't coming back. It's so bad. But maybe now I got more time. Do you think you'll be able to travel? You lost some blood. Take the watch off. It's a Rolex. Yeah. The elevator's open, let's go! I'll bring up the rear. I don't want to bleed on anyone. Oh man, that was... that was... That was the weirdest video game decision ever. We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible, and see if we can make it to an empty floor, or even the roof. You think it's possible for you? Yeah. Get going. down you okay down there remember quiet it's no big deal another arm would just get in the way jesus christ Holy crap, this guy is brave. I mean it, he's climbing with one arm up. And he's almost there, that's where it gets worse. What? Watch out! Oh man. Oh jeez. Everything okay up there? I think I just peed myself. So yes then. <laughs> okay, he still has his maybe he'll survive this after all. I don't know. Okay. It's gonna be on this floor. Wow. 
That's nothing. <laughs> Not compared to what was coming down the tracks in that one. Oh, this is a crazy episode. I give Lee credit. I mean, I was controlling him, but Lee, you can sure climb with one arm. That's crazy. Kenny went. Oh, we're still on the boat. Wasn't this city empty not too long ago? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There's thousands. Did they follow us here? It seems like it, but that can't be, can it? That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. We need to get off this roof as fast as we can. It's not safe down there. We can't just walk through the streets. You planning on growing some wings? It's taking an immense amount of willpower to not make a crack about that suggestion, coming from the one-armed man. That joke will be funnier once we know if this worked. Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. What's that feel like, Good. Arthur? Good. I, uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. He lost a lot of blood down there. Omid's right. If you see yourself getting woozy or, you know, if it didn't work, just take it easy. Well, it wasn't my favorite hand anyway. <laughs> really? Without old Lefty, I'd be done for. Shut up, Omid. <laughs> Seriously, though. Know, don't treat me any different. I got one goal, you hear me? Yeah, we do. Now what? We need to get down there and find a scared little girl. Let's try to get our bearings. So it wasn't people outside we heard. This is going to be so weird with one hand. Am I not walking around? Not going back in there. That is so weird. I don't even know how to, what it'd be like to... Walk, feel like move half of your arm. What I feel like the muscle wise moving half of an arm. Oh, that's so weird. He or she walked away from whatever accident happened. Well, that doesn't really mean much, huh? The bell tower, it's an extension ladder. Wait, the bell tower is that connected to this roof, or do we have to come across? The bell tower. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. Just need to figure out a way to get there. Oh, I said this like a little down thing. Can I look down? Guess not. Can I talk to her? Anything over here? Honestly, my vision isn't great. I think it's allergies or all that shit those walkers are kicking up. Got any good ideas for getting through that, uh, herd? I'm working on it. Are you gonna be able to hang in there? Hang in there. Have to. The mansion's that way. Yeah. If we can use that bell tower to bring them to that side of the hospital... It won't be an easy trip back toward River Street, but it wouldn't be impossible. I'm with you. Just have to get over there. Huh. I was thinking you and Omid wouldn't come with me. We can't stop looking out for each other. You two have been solid since day one. What's this? Day three? Four? Well, I appreciate it. <laughs> Allergy, that's funny. Nope. <laughs> Mead. Did it say push off or something? What was it pointing at? What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Hmm. Huh. Yeah. That could help. Hey. How's the leg? It's doing a lot better. Thanks for going into Crawford for me. 
even if it wasn't entirely for me. Clementine, too. She's tough as hell. Isn't she? Yeah. Don't worry more than you should about her, okay? I think you're Clem's favorite. Allergies, that's funny. I think the game's trying to break us up before. No. I'll see if no. we can make it out to that bell tower. Okay. Be careful, though. I don't want you going any sooner than you have to. I'm not going to try it. Even if it's not what I think it is, I'm not going to try that. I'm not going to try to break everything up. I got that who came with you score for a reason. Third place. I got to hold on to that position. So, uh, yeah. Because it's not so funny without an arm. Pick up ladder. Oh, yeah, you can't pick that up. You're an awesome Lee. You're an awesome guy, Lee. You need a hand with that? I got it. Damn it. Oh, shit. Oh, that's so. Oh. The bells. Yeah. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You shouldn't be the one to go. My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. I'll do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? I want to go because... So we're agreed then. That was real life movies. Oh, I hate heights. Maybe we should have someone more able-bodied doing that. You sure you're up for it, Lee? Say that again, and you're gonna find out. Fair enough. <laughs> the extension part. Oh! What the fuck? Holy shit, man! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit! Try to find another way out of there? I don't know, it's safe to go out. It's locked. Shit. The exit in here's locked! Um, a few solid rings of this, and there'll be thousands down below. Molly, come back and help us. Coming this way! Tons of them! Jesus! Now get back here! How? Run and jump? Eh? I'm higher up than the other building. I should be able to run and jump it. Yeah. You know. I think I have to jump! There's no way back! Fuck! Be careful! Or just a little hop. <sighs> Run, jump. Fuck, man. I don't know if I can make it. I believe in you. <gasps> yeah. Oh. Nice. No. <laughs> now let's get the hell out of here. Oh, well, that's convenient. Wow. 
Wow. This has been a crazy episode. I want to show you a... Oh. Joke. Is... Was intended. Don't just open it, there's walkers. What the f They fucked us! What? Who? Vernon! He didn't have Clem! So where the fuck is she? With someone else. We're going after her. Fuck! Just... Jesus! Wait, the cancer patients did this? Yeah, they were waiting. Tired of living underground, I guess. They kicked the shit out of me and tossed me in here. Wait, what the hell happened to you? Cut it off. Seriously? Yeah. I lived through it, which is a start. And, well, uh... I thought it might save a life. I was lucky to get bit down on the wrist, far from anything important. But who knows? Jesus. What now? Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Get over it! Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. Yeah, chill out, Kenny. Oh. We can do this in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? I know you're probably preoccupied, but don't stop thinking about the future, okay? Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill. Lee's bitten and God knows how long he has left. Clementine is who the fuck knows, and we're robbed of the only hope we've had. So? So Lee should have left your ass in Crawford. We got enough problems. Fuck you, Kenny! Kenny, stop! No, let him. I am so, so... So sorry about Katya and Duck. I am. And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead. No! You know how they die. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive, or dead, or walkers, or worse, and I don't know! So give me a fucking break! Oh, Ben, I'm... Oh, shit! Here they come! In the house! Oh, see how well this house could hold up. And on a side note, Ben... They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista. Search the house for weapons. On it. Kenny. Move anything you can up against the doors and windows. That's what I was thinking. Ben. Kill anything that gets in. You know you're talking to me, right? Ben, just do it! Omi, what is it? F 
front doors! Lee! Help! Cut their fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Hurry! Chores first. Ha! <laughs> Cleaver! Take their goddamn arms off! Oh. Oh, this is violent. Holy crap. Ah, oh, missed one. Now what? Get ready to fight. This place seems dirty to me. I think we're fine. Oh. Oh, that's that's um. Get up, That's Bry. Chop Bry. Guys, help me with this. Oh, cute. Crap. Can't take a break yet. Double Q. Everyone get to the end of the hallway. What do we do now? This will slow him down. Oh, good thing we get to the end of the hallway and take a fucking stand. Oh, man. We can't let ourselves get trapped. Let's get as many as we can. And when we see an opening, we go for it. The attic, keep the attic open. The attic, go up. Five. Four. Well, this is intense. Holy crap. Bang, bang, bang. I'm out. Can I say I'm out? I'm out! I'm out! Me too! Fuck! Where do we go? Attic! There's no goddamn opening! Oh, oh. Go! They should have done that before. Oh, screw that. They should have done that before. Well, they took out some zombies, but they wasted their ammo. They could all go out there before they start shooting. Um, I'm not good with these. You dropped it down there. Good thing I killed that boy, huh? That Whatever percentage it was who didn't. Okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay. Let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent the Third, Industrial... Mead? Krista. I'm just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. They're safe in there. I'm sorry. So, no ideas then. There's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access, a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. Hey, you're not looking great, and you're warm. I'm okay. Don't. I'm okay. I'm Lily Parrot. No. What did that mean? She's at the hotel, where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. We have to go now. 
Like right this goddamn minute. Where, Lee? Come on. We're trapped. Do you think that worked? I, I don't know. I hope so. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. Okay, what do you want to do? Just talk about it. Does that conversation end with me getting something dropped on my head? Now, hey! Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. My arm is not the issue. I'm not the problem. The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem. Yeah, maybe at the moment, but who's to say when it becomes an issue? At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me. We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. I'm sorry, okay? Fuck, we can't do this! We're gonna have to! You ruined that dude's face. <laughs> Shut up, sweetie. Look! It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. I'll be damned. We're not lifers on Alcatraz here. We can't spend the next three months digging through a wall. If the rest is as dilapidated as this, we might not have to. Let's see. This wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Everybody better use their... Yeah, we can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. I wasn't gonna hurt you. Sure, pal. I know. I'm glad you told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well. We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. Which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. I was. The fucking thing, it, it happened so fast. You ever almost hit someone in a crosswalk? Almost? His license was suspended. Twice. I'm sorry, I've been really quiet, guys. Thing was on me. Never saw it. Like someone in your blind spot. It's so weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be there. I'm hoping whatever's in their bite is gone, too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I know everyone's wondering. Even if it just slows down the process, I'd be happy. You don't mean that. So when we get this guy, what do you think? We figure out who he is, and why he's doing this. We can rescue Clem, but she won't be safe if this guy's not gonna stop. So, did your crew get into any shit before you met up with us? Is it possible to have survived and not gotten into some shit? And, you know, whatever happens to you... Uh... Seriously, can we not talk like that? <laughs> wow. The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off. What good is it to plan around that work? What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. I want you guys to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy with you two. We're not doing this right now. Krista, listen to him. 
It's what I want, okay? What about him? We uh, gotta support him. He's only a kid still. It's easy to forget that. He loses shit like that often? No, that was a first. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit on me. Kenny's been horrible to her. He blames Ben for his family's death. It's just more complicated than that. Well, seems like it got through to Kenny. Whatever that's good for. All right. I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure. If you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, hun. You can hop in after me. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. Uh, that, uh, feeling any better? I can handle it. Pain, that is. I'm just really goddamn tired. I mean, do you think it worked? Did it, did it help at all? Hmm. I feel like a man who got bitten. So, take that for what it's worth. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just... Fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would've. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. It'll be alright, kid. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Maybe take it easy on him from here on out. I'm angry as hell. Not at him. Maybe. Maybe not. You heard him outside. I did. I never really thought about it that way. This guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. Anyway, we had to make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. And I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's guts. It's all water under the bridge. All we can do is move forward. Well, cheers. Uh. <laughs> Sorry, I've been quiet this whole time, guys. I'm just through. Been... No walkers. Things are looking up. Whoa, that was kind of cool. The camera went back, and that was an interesting chapter. Everyone, keep a goddamn eye out. This place seems pretty sealed off. Well... It's like Left 4 Dead right here. She left me. A son. People that cared about us. 
I forgive her, but it don't make it any less wrong. You don't just end it, because it's hard. You stick it out, and you help the folks you care about. So let's figure a way out of here and get that little girl. Kenny's cool. We should move. They're all cool. Got at least one shot left. Huh. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee, figure out where we're headed. Okay, let's talk to everybody. Don't ask me how I'm doing. Let's just keep going. That sounds fair enough. Talk to myself. Uh, my arm's cut off. That's nice. I guess Crawford would have gotten them anyway. Judging by the decor of this room, oh, excuse I me, guess guys. they were PBS watchers. Hey, my parents' house looked a lot like this. And they watch kung fu movies. Just saying. Huh. Hard to believe the world once felt this peaceful. It's sick, but think of all the pain they avoided. <laughs> what do you call this thing? <laughs> He's like, I don't know. Art? You still with us, Bid? Yeah, Lee. I just want to help. These characters are so realistic, it's hard to... Stand right before the bed. Lee, you okay? Yeah. Let's keep at it. Shut up! No. Actually, my jokes have gone down a lot. I mean, it's time to be serious now. <laughs> they fall off! No. Here's the ladder. Fudging sense. Nothing other than personal items in here. Looks like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. Go uh, ahead. Looks kind of eh. Someone could die here. I mean, they could very well die. Someone's gonna fall and die, I swear. And I'm gonna hate this game so much. Oh, crap. Ben! Me and my fucking mouth. Holy fuck! What are we gonna do? Kenny and I can handle this. Dude, let me help you. You're already hurt. Even more reason we all don't need to risk it. You worry about her. And if all this goes bad, you might be Clementine's last hope. We'll keep an eye out. Oh. Ow. Oh. I'm okay. Shh. It's not gonna help, but I mean, is this back? I'm okay. Just get me out of here. Shh. Quiet, Ben. Or they'll be on top of us. Yeah. Try to keep your mouth shut. I'm sorry. Just get me up. My legs hurt, I think. I thought he died. We're gonna get your ass up. Hey. Really? I thought you... <gasps> oh. Fucking hell. What is it? I'm okay. I'm okay. Did it miss us? We can get you up. We can, uh... Ow! Just yank him off that thing. What? Fast, like a band-aid. Do you think... 
We have to. Get out of the fuck. Get out. How's he gonna climb? Fuck. We're not leaving him. I'm not. We don't leave anybody behind. Oh, oh god, don't let them get to me. Do you have any bullets left? This has only got one left in it. I'm out. Shit. Get the fuck out of here. What? Go back. She needs you, Lee. Kenny! This is not a discussion! Hell no, man! I'm not leaving! What did I just say? Let's get Ben and get out of here! Kitty? Lee, Lee, it's okay. Katja wouldn't want this. Damn it, Ken! Yeah, she would. I either save the kid or I get to see her. Either way. Now get back up there. Go get that girl. Back, you sons of bitches! Yeah! Damn it, Kenny! God damn it! Oh fuck! Kenny, please! What happened? I heard a shot. Kenny made sure that Ben didn't feel any more pain than he had to. What? It was Ben's biggest fear, you know. Kenny had one bullet and that's how he used it. God, poor fucking kid. I don't know what that means. Kenny did him a favor. He put Ben out and then he took it himself. You saw them die? Nobody was getting out of there. I'm sorry, Lee. He wasn't a bad guy. A lot of folks might not have always agreed. Maybe even me. We should go. Right behind you. I think Kenny's still alive. We didn't see him get attacked. We didn't see him scream. We didn't see him make any sound at all. I think he got out. I mean, I could be off on a long shot. But I think he got out. Do you want to talk? Kenny was my friend. Soon as someone dies, they don't immediately have to have their sins forgiven. He was what passes for a friend now. I understand. Look, Lee, this is a shitty time, but I want to clear something up. What is it? Now with Kenny gone, means Omid and I have to stay safe. For her. You guys would be great for her. Keep her safe. We do our best. You know that. Are you okay? I should be asking you that. Before, in the attic. It's nothing. 
What's nothing? Let's just keep moving. Fuck. Be careful across here. They're going across together. I don't like this. And that is where I'm going to end episode 17. At least I think it's 17 or it's 18. One of them. Um, I'll go with 17, and it's, it's 17, okay. So guys, this has been Chrome Trigger with episode 17 of The Walking Dead. And we've been through a lot. I think this recording's long. So if you like my video, my commentary, give me a thumbs up. If you go the extra mile, subscribe, but even better as it gets much more out there. And let me know I'm doing a good job. We'll see you guys in episode 18 of The Walking Dead. Thanks guys, Chrome Trigger out.